Good morning, and thank you all for joining us today. My name is Meg Sneed, and I'm the Acting Secretary of the Pennsylvania Department of Human Services. And a quick shout out to my daughter, Maeve, who's in second grade, who's joining us here today. The past two years of the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic have caused health and economic insecurity for so many Pennsylvanians. While we've made progress and our economy is not in the same position that it was in during the worst months of the pandemic, we know that many are still feeling the impact of this disruption. That's why I'm excited to share with you today the Department of Human Services is launching a new program for Pennsylvanians who need help paying their water bills. Many of us take for granted the ability to turn on our taps when we brush our teeth or wash our hands or make a meal. But water is foundational to our lives and clean drinking water and access to wastewater services are essential to help families stay healthy and live safely in their homes. No Pennsylvanian should, have access to this should not have access to this important resource because of financial difficulty. That's why DHS is launching the Low Income Household Water Assistance Program, or LIWAP. The Water Assistance Program gives those with low incomes the chance to get, their, get help paying their drinking water and wastewater bills. This temporary assistance program was established through the American Rescue Plan Act and the Consolidated Appropriations Act of 2021. Pennsylvania received approximately $43.2 million to provide water assistance to those in need. Applications for the Water Assistance Program are available starting tomorrow, January 4th. This program is for those who have past due water bills, had their service terminated, or received a notice that their service will be terminated in the next 60 days. Households can receive water assistance grants for both drinking water services and wastewater services. Grants are issued directly to water service providers and families must meet income requirements. If you already receive utility or emergency rental assistance, you can also receive water assistance as long as you meet the eligibility criteria. Information on the water assistance program is available on our website, www.dhs.pa.gov slash water help. You can also go to one of DHS's county assistance offices to receive support in person or you can request a paper application or get help applying for assistance by calling customer service centers at 215-560-7226 for Philadelphia clients or 1-877-395-8930 for clients in all other counties. As we look ahead to the new year, DHS is ready to help if you or your family are experiencing financial hardship. We can help with past due or upcoming rent and utilities, cash assistance for families and other needs like health care and food. If you or a loved one, friend or neighbor needs help, we are here for you. Go to dhs.pa.gov to find out more and apply for services. And please, if you know someone who is in need, help us spread the word by letting them know these programs are available. DHS exists to help during difficult times and moments we cannot plan for. As we continue to navigate the challenges created by this pandemic, please know that we're here and ready to help. I'd now like to introduce Gladys Brown Dutrell, Chairwoman of the Pennsylvania Ut Utility Commission. Good morning. I want to thank, take this opportunity to thank Acting Secretary Meg Sneed for inviting the Public Utility Commission to this press conference. These issues are very important to all of our consumers here in Pennsylvania. As we grapple with the health and financial impacts of COVID-19, the pandemic, we know that there are households across the state facing the uncertainty and the stress of worrying about their utility bills, including some who've never had to experience these problems before. As part of our campaign of Call Utilities Now, the PUC encourages consumers to learn more about this new program that's called LIWAP. Direct conversations between consumers and utilities about the eligible, eligible programs are the best first step that any Pennsylvania household or business struggling to keep their utilities on can take. We know that LIWAP will assist Pennsylvania families who are behind in their drinking and wastewater bills to ensure that their service remains active. 
One of the quickest and easiest ways to identify available options like this new programs is to call utilities now. Utilities understand the assistance of programs that are available in their communities for income qualified consumers. They can also help enroll you in assistance programs, guide you toward other available resources and discuss payment plans and other options to help consumers move forward. Also, be sure to call all your utilities. We emphasize this, your electric, your natural gas, your water and wastewater and telecommunications because each of them may have different programs or resources available to you, the consumer. I also urge everyone in a difficult situation to pick up the phone and call utilities now to learn about what options are available. Don't wait for that past due bill or a termination notice. And a lot of people do that. Don't wait before you work to address any problems that you may have. And also, if any of your family members have problems or friends or neighbors who you think may be having problems, encourage them also to do the same thing. So the launch of the Low Income Household Water Assistance Program, or what we're calling LIWAP, is a great opportunity to start the new year secure and connected. So once again, I want to thank Acting Secretary Sneed for inviting the PUC to be part of this press conference, and I am available to answer any questions along with Acting Secretary Sneed. Total amount of money available in the program, did you say it was $43.2 million? I think it's $43.5 million. Let me just double check. <coughs> you, did, you were right, $43.2 million. And that's, that's what's available for to be given out in grants to people who need the assistance. Correct, through the LIWAP program. And that money came from the American Rescue Plan and? And the Consolidated Appropriations Act of 2021. So the 2021 budget and the American Rescue Plan Act. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, no other questions. Thank you all so much.